Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Orogiri. So this video is born out of both let's do another how to farm a stone guide and I need inferno stones to make a new supreme so let's just like you know get at it. Do them uh, two birds one stone. Oh shit. The wordplay is real. So hey gamer loco hey sapphire. Um, so Inferno Stones, right? So we don't talk about these often. They're used for actually a lot of weapons. Um, Inferno Stones, late game wise, Inferno Stones are used for Fallen Star. They're used for Abyss. They're used for Supreme. And they might be used for other things that I'm not too keen about or know about. But they are needed for Confining Terror. So, um, you know, lots of uses for Inferno Stones. So hey guys, glad you're all showing up to the stream so like I said um, I actually just got my last hell horn today for um, to make uh, a wind supreme that I've been wanting to make and for that I'm going to need about a hundred and fifty inferno stones yeah that one will probably take fire stones to inferno stones do I know if we're gonna get an update or something tomorrow um, if tomorrow is our two-year Onigiri anniversary, they haven't said anything for it yet. Um, in my speculation, like, me and my friends, we think that's just gonna come next month. Like, either they just say, like, oh, hey, surprise, like, anniversary, like, they just either just give us stuff, or they'll do something It's like, for next month. I, I think they could do it next month, because most people play November, October anyway. Either than that, they might have forgotten. I don't really know what's to think of our anniversary. But, um, yeah, I'm not too, too sure about what they're going to do for our, our anniversary. I don't think it's going to be an update or anything, but it'd be very easy for them just to, like, patch in or whatever. Like, hey, um, you know, here, here's, like, 300 OC for everybody or 200 OC for the two-year anniversary. And then, like, two gotch, two of everything. I don't know. I, I'm just making stuff up. But I, I really have no... Um, no real opinion on the um, potentials of an anniversary thing. Because they haven't said anything about it. Um, so I'm not too, too sure. Honestly. Um, so yeah, recipe-wise, I'm going to pull it up here. So I need to get 100... Or I had to get about 100 stones, Inferno stones. Um, yeah, because I can make the Reverence 3, which takes, um, you know, a seal, three hell horns, claws... Lightstones, you know, lightstones are pretty easy comparatively to the Supreme, which is going to take Inferno Stones. So I had about 40 Inferno Stones before. I'm up to 90. So I need to get 60 Inferno Stones. And I hope to do that while also making a guide of how to, um, you know, go about getting Inferno Stones. So there were times in the past where... I've alluded to like what mags drop what kinds of stones, but those have been kind of diluted and lost within streams. Like they'd be happening like 50 minutes in the stream. I'll say, oh, you guys can do this. It's like, oh, well, only people that watch that specific stream would know. And it's not very readily available knowledge, but just real quick, I'll run through it. So if you break it down into types, um, power type mags, everything in this column, except for like 105 is infused. Well, I guess they can, but you shouldn't break those down for this purpose. Um, everything in this column, Warrior's Boon is fantastic. You're absolutely right. I'm glad you reminded me of it. But everything in this column, in the Power Mags, has a chance of giving you Piercing Stones, Crushing Horn Stones, and Cutting Stones. Um, in the Defensive Mags, I'm not too, too sure about it because I don't just make and break them. So sadly, I don't know what these can give. Sadly. But I do know that Mind Mags, which is why we make and break Mongokus, give us Thunderstones, Darkstones, and Ice Stones. So that's great. And Mind Mags, so the kind, or Mind mind Type, I guess. Mind Type, except for New Moon, like don't work on New Moon. The ones you want to make are Harvest Knight, Komo Kazuchi, and Mochizuchi. These three have a chance of breaking down into Light and Inferno Stones. So that's why I like to just collect Matsutake Mushroom every now and again to make some Ochizuchis. 
Because I did break some down earlier, and I did get some Inferno Stones. But um, Komo Kazuchi and Harvest Knight are going to be the two we're going to focus on in this video. So, and obviously there is the Warrior's Boon, which we can go and farm if you want. But I find the drop rate on Warrior's Boon isn't that great unless you're on, um, you know, Login, Fever, or some combination of things. But Warrior's Boons will drop from the flies and worms in um, Minor Delusions in, a, in a Oshu. But yeah, so each of these takes a different stone, and that's what's important. With Reduction, they only take one stone, so it's not that bad. Um, Komo Kazuchi takes 5 Baby Bottles and 10 Withering Spirits. Withering Spirit comes from the Reapers, and Baby Bottle comes from Birds. So I already have 100 Baby Bottles, so that's why I'm going to try and make as many of these as I can and it shouldn't be too too hard to get withering spirit if you know where to go and alternatively harvest night is miracle stone so if you have more miracles you know you play with your strengths it takes bell of curse god and broken fishing rod and it takes three rods and one bell and I'm gonna show you a really really good place to get both of these drops so that's gonna be great um, and I think these mags give you Miracle and Fortitude Stone and the occasional um, Cutting Stone and Crushing Horn. They're really weird. And then the other mags can give you pretty much anything. But primarily, these are going to be the ones you want for Inferno Stone farming. And Warrior's Boon is a pink mind mag. And um, what's the other one? Um, Igetsu is really good too. Like if you're ever farming... like cat. It gets who doesn't come from cat, but if you wanted a dungeon that just drops these mags, like let's say you're on like a login or a boost, like if you went and farmed Palace of Rain, like just don't even worry about the boss, just farmed it, you will find a lot of Komo Kazuchis, Mochizuchis, Usagetsu, things like that. Dew Creek as well, and you can break them down for Inferno Stones. So anything that's a mind mag has a chance of giving you Inferno Stones. So the one we're going to go try and farm first is... Um, the um, Komo Kazuchi. So I'm going to go to a place where I can fight some Reapers. So if you want to ask me any questions while we're farming, by all means. Because this, as much as it is a guide, like, the first part of it's a guide. Like, go farm these mags, break them down, you'll get Inferno Stones, you'll get Light Stones. That's what you're going to get. But now I'm going to go farm the places. While, like, it's sort of like a guide stream sort of thing. So it should be fun. But what, what's your what's your question, Sapphire? What, what's, what's your optophic thing, man? Let's keep it going. If Supreme with crit mod comes, should I make that over the Fallen Star? If Supreme with crit modifier comes. You try to say if Supreme comes with a modifier? Um, I don't even know what Roblox is. But, um... Fallen Star has a modifier as well. Fallen Star actually has like the biggest modifier at 30% and Supreme has a modifier of 10% and it's really on a spectrum of what you want. Like Fallen Star has more fire and potentially more attack until you're 128. Um, isn't the Supreme, isn't there a Supreme that comes like Night Sky? Well Supreme is just 10%. Supreme is like a dragon arc, like a regular dragon arc. It's a 10% chance based on fire. Whereas Fallen Star is a 30% chance based on fire. But Fallen Star cuts your crit down in half. Supreme doesn't. So Supreme's going to be more consistent damage with your crit. But Fallen Star is going to be more extreme. Like when you get that low chance to crit and that higher chance at a damage modifier... You'll see more overcaps than you will... Like, you'll see more overcaps on Fallen Star than you will on Supreme. Because it's a 10% chance compared to, to a 30% um, plus whatever your crit is. So, it's pretty... Like, it's, it's really just two sides of, like, the same coin, really. It's just one's a little heavier than the other. So, I'm coming to Lacus Mortis because Lacus Mortis is riddled riddled with reapers reapers everywhere so oh there's a bodies no jutsu i'm dropping in this one with my boy narao give him them bodies 
So I got Miyamoto with me. That's great. I'm going in. And we're going to try and get as many um, Withering Spirit as I can. Sadly, we just had Fever and I was here all weekend and I didn't think to pick up Withering Spirits. Do you think it would be better to do Supreme over Fallen Star? I basically only have Flame Lance for Fire. Um, like, it's, it's, it's really up to you. Like, Supreme is a way easier weapon to make. Honestly, like, if you have, like, uh, all the drops for it, Lunar Spirit Seal and stuff, like, both are good. Like, if you're just at one, but you get Fallen Star at 124, and you get access to Supreme at 125, so, hmm, it's really up to you. Um, I think they're both really good. Um... They both have, like, the physical element. There's really no loss, I want to say. Like, you just do whichever. That's true. That's a very, very good point. That's actually a, an amazing point. Is that... The f Tempest, right? Like, your mags or the drops from that are needed to make Tempest. So then make the Supreme first, and then use the Drops for Tempest. I completely agree with that sentiment. Absolutely. Oh boy. We're going to kill more guys. Well, Miyamoto's going to kill more guys. I'm not going to be in all chat. That's going to be ridiculous. Like, I feel like if you have the option, Supreme, make it first. It's really easy to make. Like, compared to, like, a plethora of other weapons in the game, Supremes and Reverences are very easy. Like, very, very easy. So, yeah, Withering Spirits, very, very easy to get them here. I am overusing the word easy. But, like... And some people might be like, you're doing Lacus on Hell with like Miyamoto and Tempest and a Vanguard with 150 and Ifrit. How the hell is this easy? The answer to that, yes. So, <laughs> it, it's a really good spot for, you know, Reapers. It's not the easiest spot. Obviously, you could just go to like Nether Seki and farm to your heart's content. But I'm like, I might as well come here because you never know if an Akatsuki Yami is going to drop or... Whatever, I'm already on the moon, and I just know there's a lot of guys here, so... Oh my god. And it's good for our Oni Nodachi farming because of the, um, sinister bones you get. Lots of things you get in Lacus. Withering spirits for days. Make my phone buzz, what was it saying? Yep, it is. What the hell? Where do you... Oh, that's what she's saying. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. I don't think there's any Reapers in this hallway, so I'm not going to worry about the drops. How would you guys feel if Onigiri had, like, an offline farming thing? So, like, let's say you were away, you could, like... The way I always saw it is you could, like, send vanguards you don't normally use. Like, you could send them on missions to do things for you. It's like, oh, you, would you like to send Lunastasia to farm Palace of Rain for you for, like, an hour while you're away? Or something like that. Like, I would love that. Like, to send vanguards away and it would take their stamina and stuff. And based on, like, what type the boss is, like, you need to have types for that, this and that. I think that'd be stupendous. I'd love that. Like, you sent Sasuke on a mission to this, and... I'd love that so much. It's like, hey, go farm this for me. Go farm this. And then it'd just be like, yay, there's a point to having so many different vanguards all the time. Yay.
I don't know. Fight me. I've noticed that one video. Like, one video has like 20 dislikes. I don't know what it was that about. But all I know is that if something is disliked heavily, people will watch it. Like, if something's disliked for no reason, it's like, oh, why is this disliked? And they will watch it. But, yeah, I don't I don't know what's so dislikable about that one video. I should watch it again. Yeah, one of them has 20. Like, it's just, like, 20. I'm like, oh, okay. Apparently they didn't like whatever I was doing. Like, just 20 and nothing else. Just like, just one. Is it recent? It was probably made during... Fe it was one of the streams on Fever. Like, it's probably what it was. Oh, boy. How many Reapers are there in this dungeon? It is in a way, yeah. Uh... I thought the the Hoten Kyush attack, the one where he just takes the sword out and charges, I thought that was pretty good. Hoten Kyush. Or that's Raijin that says Hoten Kyush. That's all I know. Are you ice? Oh, their skills are exactly the same? Okay. Then the one where he has the sword in the mouth and he does a little charge? I like that one. And the one where he does like a bunch of drills of wind? That one's really good too. My God. Are they all dead yet? Like, oh my goodness. Okay, a door has opened. But there's still enemies here. What the hell? You probably don't need to run the whole dungeon for this drop, now that I'm thinking about it. Like, the first floor is really all you need. But I'd run this floor- I'd do this a room anyway, just in case a mag drop that I want. Please let me use an attack. That'd be fan fucking -tastic. Okay, get out of my way, thank you. I don't want a Necromata. Why did I stop using... Why did I stop using the red cup? Because... Um, the gold cup is like 50% boast? Cyber- Hello Cyrus that blows. What's up? Complaining about what? Specifically. Oh, I gotta kill this dude.
The only things we complain about are owning Odachis, Ronins, and um, DCing. Why not replace the third cup? Well, the red cup does make you drink something twice. So it is like more drunkenness. But um, the third cup for me is just moth orchid. And I don't want to put it in something that just takes more. There's You don't need to use a really good cup for moth orchid. Because it's just moth orchid. Like, it's just one thing. And I don't really need that many. They either have to be 5 out of 10. Is there really that bad of me to complain about how binary vanguards are? The skull is like 40. It's like half the time, but it's 50% bonus. So Tail of Genji is like 45 um, rain in the gold cup. It, it's basically the candle that burns twice as bright burns half as long. That's that's what the that's what the cup is. So for like a shorter amount of time, you get like 45 element instead of 30, whereas. The red cup would give me, like, more drunkenness and the other one. You prefer Miss Tengu? Yeah, but I use, like, a lot more rain, I guess. For more stacks of rain? No. I don't think so. I've honestly never tried. Tell you the truth, I've never just, like, got shit-faced on Element. Oh, you can't... I don't know. We'll find out after this run. Well, su not su Supreme, but Reverence 3 will, absolutely. Like, I mean, you could probably put, like, let's say, Miss Tengu in, like, two different cups and see what happens. I don't use Chidori anymore, so... Is that all the Withering Spirits we got? No. There's, like, three guys right there. Withering Spirit. Withering Spirit. And Withering Spirit. It is, but with my mags, I'm at 80 cooldown anyway. <laughs> yeah. Like, Chidori was good. It's probably your best friend in the entire game, but... I've grown too strong. I must leave my sensei. Move on to greener pastures. Okay, like really quick, I'm gonna ask you guys, should I fight the boss because I came this far in the dungeon? Oh, Zabiva. 
So I just want withering spirits. After? Yeah, let's do it. Fuck yeah. Okay. I'm gonna hate that. Without Ifrit? Fuck, Ifrit's like dead. Oh! I hate Reapers, man. Yeah, I do, yeah. Wow. What's a Lance? What's a Lance to a I'm Invincible? Please die. You know, I got like no mags today at all. Like, no mags in this dungeon. Five man, fuck it. But like to efficiently farm um, Inferno Stones, I would only do the first floor of this dungeon. If that was all you wanted was Withering Spirits, I would just do the first floor. I wouldn't just drag out the whole dungeon. I can only spam Firelands so much, please die. Please stop. Stupid Reaper. Can never tell if they're invincible or invincible at all. just die. These reapers are really annoying. Like, why didn't I bring my else in? Two days ain't that bad. Alright, it's time to die. a cutscene. I haven't done this in months. Literal months I haven't done this. He changed his look. He doesn't usually have a fist out, does he? What was that? He's got his like fist out. He's looking like a badass. Kiji, why are you mad at me, boy? Ow, fuck. Fuck, how do you do this again? Okay. So stand here and then move. Keep shopping going the whole time so I don't get hurt. I heard her last scrolls were like seal drop rate, like they were bad. All right, you just stay here. Can I just kill them? Like with Flash? No, maybe. Oh, it's that one. Fuck. Oh, fuck. I completely forget how to do this. Wow, it hit me from there. 
Fuck. I don't like this. <laughs> I'm not rolling for ho -Oh. Fuck no. Not till she comes back. Is this the last wave? What did I get? An S or an A? S, really? Oh shit, son! Fucking Ibis Mag, let's go! <laughs> I can already see the comment. Eva's like, if you would have got a fucking spirit in one run, I would have deleted this game and called you a hacker. Yep. I'll not roll until that other unit comes out. You're damn right. <laughs> okay, so main question is how many wandering spirits did we get? Because that's the whole point of this video. Not to do a 22 minute lack of lack us run. No, no, no. Don't delete your. Okay, so Withering Spirits. How many is actually in that dungeon? 63! There are 63 Reapers in that dungeon. So 63. That's quite a bit. I'm actually going to do another run, but I'm just, I'm just going to do a half run. Ifrit, come here. Ifrit, come here. I'll just do a half run to cap out on Spirits, and then we'll go um, making them up. <sighs> Um, I'd probably make it in a separate stream. Because this is just about Inferno Stones. Mia, come here.
Like that's how much damage it is. Fuck, son. Sign me up. How long does it take for you to run Lucifer once? Um, like, you asking me with like Ifrit and stuff, or just me on my character? Like, just me on my character, like, how it takes like two, three minutes? I don't know. Um, Hell. Uh, mm, hell takes me about like eight minutes, but I, that's using Ifrit and stuff. Any way possible, hell takes me about eight minutes. I'm slow. And that's like fighting him with fire. I'm weird like that. There's still more of these guys? The dragon art dropped a Hisakata? Nice. I had to drop my um, wild goose when I needed it. Oro, come. What's alive? Oh. Get out of here, son. Oh yeah, Fallen Star, Suzaku kicks his ass. Sadly, none of the times are recorded because it's from Reward Up. It's probably some bullshit like Susano can only hold open the gate to the underworld for this much time. You have this much time to go in and kick their ass. It's probably something like that. Or maybe it's Fujin and Raj, I don't know, but some bot, some god's gonna be like, I can only hold open the gateway to the underworld for so long. Please only do it. They need to bring back the Arami Tamas. Like, I want Oni Mode Juncture. Like, we need that. We really do. Susano can suck my head. Lucky him. Okay, how many spirits did I get? Because I, if I have like 90, I'm leaving. I don't even need 90. Withering spirit. 92. Alright, let's get out of here. 
So yeah, every first room of this dungeon, every first floor is about 30 on 5-man hell. Don't DC me, you slut. Oh my god. That's so stupid. I did two runs. I just reset my game. You're kidding me. You're fucking kidding me. Like, wow. Well, I don't know if I have the stones that fire. We might not get it. We still got other things to farm. I'm just going to call it Infernal Stone Part 2. Because I can't guarantee I'm getting 100 Infernal Stones. No way in hell I can guarantee that. Or not 100, but 50 or 60, 60 Infernal Stones. I can't guarantee it. Oh. 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 The game isn't over. What should my character type be for a wand alt? Um, kind. Ibaraki, what? No. You just want to see Keiji you no know, Kimi's tentacles just like go after. I know you. Is today the 4th or the 5th? October 5th, we survived a DC. Yeah, it does. Yes, it does. Did they get rid of stone dungeons? No. This Infernal Stones was on Tuesday and I did like three of them. <laughs> Not going on Gashima, that's for damn sure. You can suck my... I am not going on Gashima. Not after surviving her DC. 110, Blue Moon Blade. How is this even possible? You did. Cool. Wow. You must have been honored. You should have been like carrying me. That sword's so heavy it carried you. <laughs> oh, ho, ho, ho. Good old Frieza laugh. Okay, where's Kage in this town? Why? Why is Kaga laggy? No one should be in Kaga, period. Why is it laggy? It's like skipping every two seconds. There's no reason for Kaga to be laggy. Holy shit. <laughs> that embarrassed. That outclassed. Oh yeah, the song. Oh, Whisper? Alright. Okay, so we're gonna craft some Como Chizuchi. Mags, because that's what we farmed. I don't. We can make like... Nine. Fuck. Ugh. You get more mileage out of your baby bottles, but you need a lot of withering spirits. I 
All right, so let's break them down. See if we get any, um, because you're either going to get Inferno or Lightstone. That's the, um, those are your two options. Or like a physical stone, like Crushing Horn or something stupid. But generally, it's either Inferno or Light. Oh, we made a lot of these, actually. Hey! Inferno stones. What do we get from this one? Crushing Horn and Light. Okay. Well, we might get enough spirits to make another one, so that's not too bad. Let's break them down. Inferno Stone, hey! That's eight. Woohoo! Let's break it down. More Inferno Stones! That's twelve. Woohoo! Fifteen more to go. Fifty more to go. Oh, five! Woo! Crushings. These, that's great. Those are great odds. This is great. That made the whole video worth it because I actually got something farming. Holy God. More light stones, not too bad. Six light ain't too bad. It's no Mongoku, but it, it'll get the job done. Crushing, withering spirits. So we should be able to make at least two more, assuming we got enough broken down stuff. And more Inferno, woo! -hoo! And we'll break down these Mochizuchis, because I made them earlier. And Crushing Horn, Reverse Compass. I'd be delighted if it gave me some Infernos, though. Light. More light stones, okay. Well, wow, someone came home. Surprise. <laughs> Alright, so let's see how many stones we got. And how many we have left to get. I don't know why I talked to you, Baraki. Um, you're not Yoshitsune. Why am I talking to every wrong person? Why is this place so laggy? Nothing happens in this town. So how many did we get? We got about 20 Inferno Stones from all that. So we need to get 30. No, we got about 30. No, I don't want to give you a present. Stop lagging my game, please. So let's actually try to see if we can make some more Komo Kazuchis from what we broke down. We can make two more. Not too bad. It's another shot at Inferno Stone, so I'll do it. I'm gonna go and break these down real quick. Real slick. Should be the top two in recent. You always say that, but joyful. And Inferno Stone. All right, so we got enough to make another word, another one too. All right. So that's more Inferno Stones we got. Like I literally had forty Inferno Stones today, 
And now I have like 20 away from my goal. So I'd say Komokazuchi is a good endeavor. What? How can it be fake? Like, I mean, I know how you can have a fake one, but... Alright, so now our next one on our list to try and farm with is the Harvest Knight. Now, this is the old one we used to do, and there is a reason I came to Kaga, because there is a dungeon with both Broken Fishing Rod and Bell the Curse God in it. And it is in Kaga, and it is one of my favorite dungeons of all time. So let's try and see if we can find another body party, because we lost our last one. Due to... Am I still in that body party? No, okay. I want to make sure it wasn't broken. Are there really no body parties? Like, really? Oh, no, Hunter's got one. Okay. I'll join this one here. Cherokee Wolves 122? Where in the world? What's happening in the world? Alright, so three people should be enough. Should be more than enough. And where we're going to go to farm this is Momiji Well. Momiji Well has always been one of my favorite dungeons in the game. I love it. So much. Momiji Well. Tristan does have the best butt. And apparently we DC'd again. What? It's the best dungeon. But apparently we DC it again because this game hates me. Oro's your vanguard? Oro is the best vanguard. <sighs> okay, so this time I know the streams are not going to come back. So I'm going to restart the stream, do Farming Inferno Stones Guide Part 2, and we'll go from there. So if you guys want to come back, refresh your browser in about um, two minutes.